see what tonight brings. Okay, here's a riddle for you. What's got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark? This fool, well, one thumb, one available thumb. Okay. And it was here, on a strange, uninhabited island that this brave young soul found herself. Okay, full disclosure, I've suddenly found myself on a, a strange, tiny little island all alone with nothing to do but show you guys around. So, there's a tree house over there. I'm going to go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Because here's the thing. Not that I want to go back because I don't, but even if I did... I can't, because then I'd look like the super needy one when he was the one who, who stormed off in the first place. You know what? Sorry, I'm venting. Oh, explore venting. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. <laughs> All right, let's go over here. No prizes for guessing what these are. Can't say that I've used them. A little too au naturel for me, TVH. You know, I've never thought about where the waste goes. Oh. Oh, please, God, no. Okay. We're gonna just go ahead and ignore that. Yeah. All right. What's, what's this? Here, here, over here. Let's continue over here. Let me see what this is all about over here first, before I continue on the st other stairs. That you, Jacob? All right, that was kind of creepy. Go over here. Any um clues for me? Let's go over here now. Anything else? Anything else? No. Doesn't seem like it. Alright, let's continue. Over here. shelter. It's a shelter where you meet at. Okay, I'm trying really hard to make this interesting, but sometimes a thing just is what it is. I think I've made my point. All right. This island is like an unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? You know, when I was little, I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now and realize that not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man-child. He's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why, why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> oh, look. A metaphor in the narrative by mean of fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life? 
I guess since this isn't live, the choice is up to me. I go up here. Okay, moving up in the world. Let's do this. Now you might notice the darling rustic vibes this walkway is radiating, and that's no accident. I don't know what y'all are doing with your walkways, but if you're not spending a full hour pulling a splinter out of a snotty kid's finger, don't you dare call it authentic. Don't worry, the kid was fine. I'm a good counselor. And what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. All right. Any more cards? Please find any more cards on those tarot cards. I need them. I really do. All right. It's over here. Okay, what was that noise? What's that noise? All right. Let's continue over here. This is where we're heading. Not too shabby. Well, literally is too shabby, but these views, oh man, you're going to blow your tops. There's also a zip line, which eh, I guess you can watch me crap my pants on that thing. What the hell? I'm here, aren't I? I'm going to carpe this DM so damn hard it won't know what hit it. First, we got to get there. And there's still so much to talk about. I hope Abby's okay. She ran off earlier. If you didn't see it, I kind of sort of made out with Nick. But it was a dare. I'm not like a bitch or anything. Oh, and for context, Abby likes Nick. Well, actually, they like each other. In truth... I just wanted to fan the flames a little. Watching them stumble around each other like drunk jellyfish was exhausting. Poor kid was like a deer in headlights. It's cool though, they're smart. They'll get it. I bet they're out there in the woods right now, just absolutely going for it. All right. I go that way or this way. Hmm. Let's go like this way first. See what's the issue over here. Oh look, car keys. Police car keys. I think this Please car keys. What's this? Ah. Okay, let's do this now. Maybe one of those I'm sorry, officer, I have no idea what you're talking about situations. So I'm just going to go ahead and leave those right there. All right. Let's go on over here. Can you go over there? Nope. All right. Let's see over here real quick. Let's go up here real quick. Oh no. Oh yeah, there's a zip line, okay. Okay, let's continue. I was looking for cards, but never mind. And here we are, as promised, one extremely rickety and even more underwhelming treehouse. In another world, perhaps young Jacob and I would settle down here and play house together. 
Honey, I'm home. What's that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well now, that's a fine how do you do. Take it all in, folks. That's the summer camp experience right there, and... Oh, look. It seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their stuff, or maybe one of the guys back there? But... I don't recognize this. Oh, uh, uh, no. Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belongings? Or do we open the spooky trapdoor and die a horrible, painful death? There are literally no right answers. Search bag. Bag it is. And you know what? I'm putting some clothes on. This is all you're getting. There's something up there, and it is not gonna make me jump. I can promise you that much. <sighs> Goodbye, cruel world. The final curtain is calling, and there's no time for an encore. Oh, oh no. Oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. Use taser. Attack photo. Go, 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 go. Taser, taser, taser! Spray! Go up now. Block door. Use bear spray. No. Taser! Go, 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 go! Oh. I got it. He's okay. Are you in pain? No, no, sorry. I'm just... I'm really hungry. We'll get you some food inside, okay? Yeah, yeah. Come on, come on. Oh, man. I can eat a horse. Well, I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola? Oh, yuck, I hate granola. Strength. 
This will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something to eat. You and I are gonna find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yup. We'll come meet you. Copy that. I really hope they're gonna be okay. Do you think that whatever's left in the nurse's office is gonna cut it? Caitlin knows what she's doing. Does she? I, I mean, she wasn't even supposed to be working at the nurse's office this summer. She only filled in because some other girl didn't show up. It's better than nothing. <sighs> Come on, let's go call for backup. It's pretty weird to see this place so dead. You never came down here at night while camp was in session? What? No, did you? A couple times, yeah. Damn. Where are you going? I, 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 I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. I think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. Well, that's good news. Yeah. So what now? We got a call for help. Who should I call? Uh, Mr. H? The only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then 911. You mean 911? Who says 911? I don't know. I... Anyway, yeah, but like, what should I ask for? Like, police? Ambulance? Huh. Well, do you need to specifically ask for an ambulance, or can you just say, like, help, help? So they'll say, 911, what's your emergency? And I'll say, help, help. My friend may have been attacked by a bear, or maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And we're not sure how many there are out there right now, uh, and or how smart they are. So they may be mounting an attack on us right now. So just, like, send a whole bunch of ambulances just to be sure. Yeah, yeah, that's that's good. Okay. Nine one one. What's wrong? Dead. Well, that's weird. Phones go dead sometimes out here. Right when you're about to call the cops, though. It's a coincidence. Did you try the hang-up thingy? What? Here. What are you doing? I don't know. It's what they do in movies when the phone goes dead. You tap on the little thingy. We're not in a movie. Okay. Well, you know, how do you know that? Maybe that's just what they want you to think, man. Okay, so this phone's a no-go. No one has signal. Is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Well, not a landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably rig something up and get a message out. All right, yeah. Let's, let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. I will put it back when we're good and safe and help is on the way. Uh, okay, just careful with it. I'll be fine. Okay. Uh, it's, it's probably the weather. What weather, Ryan? Maybe, maybe it was the bears. Bear.
And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay, so for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power, what if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. We should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaked. Yeah, okay, yeah, let's go. Oh my god. Yeah, we should probably leave that with Caitlin. Do you think she really needs it, though? Uh, she needs it just as much as we do. If she's staying in the lodge, we're going out there. You literally just said there might be something dangerous in the lodge. When? Like 20 seconds ago. Okay, sure, but that's because I really wanted the gun. Just give her the gun, man. Give gun. I feel bad. <sighs> All right. You're right. Hey, we'll still have mine. If you're extra nice to me, I'll, I might let you hold it. Don't write a check that your ass can't cash. My ass has got quite the bank account. Am I interrupting something? Chin up, big guy. It, I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. Quickly. Really? to see you. Good to see you. Oh, a time again, is it? Strength. <laughs> Strength can be surprising. Knowing one's own raw power, tapping into it, tapping into a previously unknown energy. I suppose there are forces that work within us all. And with one hand it gives, and with the other it could rip away. 
As always, there's more to see. And as always, the choice is yours. Would you like to see more? Why not? So it's goodbye again. I'll leave you with this. Remember who your friends are. Remember who's looking out for you. Chapter 5 White Noise Hey, I couldn't find anything to eat. The kitchen's pretty cleaned out. Oh shoot, I left my bag. I, I brought you this. That was... Fuck, I don't even know what happened. It was all just a blur. How are you feeling? I'm okay. I'll be okay. Thanks to you. No, no, I, I just helped a little. It was all Caitlin and Ryan. You're here with me. That helps. All right, they're off to find a radio or something. What's with the, um, the... Oh, uh, they found another in Mr. H's office, so just in case. And what happened to the lights? Not sure. Any better? I'm doing okay. Kinda. Wait, are they going to the radio hut? Phone's dead. They're gonna try to send out an SOS or something. We're holding down the fort. Did anybody else hear that? Shh. Said Dylan and Ryan already left. Right, stay here. I'll check it out. We'll be fine. Just be careful. Stay alert. Oh, that's so scary.
No sign of them. When you find them, blood them. And keep me posted, Bobby. Yes, you're breathtaking. No! Hey, so this may not be like the best time per se, but like... Yeah, so like I was just, you know, thinking about like the start of summer and when we first met and the start of camp and well, like now that summer's over and, you know, is that like the last time we're going to see each other, you know? Oh, I'm sorry, Nick, what, what are you saying? Hey, I'm kind of pouring my heart out here. Nick, I'm, I'm sorry. Can we talk about this later? I'm, I'm really freaked out. And it's just not a good time. Maybe I was misreading the situation back there, but... kind of felt like a little bit more was going to happen. Well, did you want a little bit more to happen? Duh, are you dumb? Hey. Sorry. I just mean... Of course I wanted it to happen, I just didn't know if you did too. That seems like such a long time ago now. You did want it to happen though. Uh, um, I... You can tell me. Yeah, I, I guess. <laughs> You're just saying that because I'm hurt. Nick. What's going on out there, Caitlin? We have died. We have died. It's okay. I got this. Oh my God! What happened? Jesus, where's the gun? We gotta get out. No, we have to hide. Hide. Yes. So the radio hut has like an actual radio? I thought it was just like for your morning announcements. Oh yeah, yeah. It used to be more of a actual radio station actually. Um, uh, you know, I mean, it is still technically, but nobody brings their radio to camp anymore. Yeah. It's weird actually that there used to be kids with their radio and their portable CD player and everything and... You know, nowadays, everything we need is on the phone, but Mr. Hackett takes it on the first day at camp so that we're not distracted by technology. Um, technology, it giveth and it taketh. So okay, is, guys. Is that something, like, that you want to go into? Uh, camp radio? No, like, uh, DJing or music or something. Oh, um, yeah, I mean, I like 
music, but I think I want to major in um, quantum physics. Okay, guys, I'm going to leave it off here. What? <sighs> yeah. Uh, you don't really seem like a science guy. <laughs> oh, yeah, I mean, you know, not, not here. Um... Okay, guys. Thanks for watching.